Hi, I'm Mary Ann Dell, Pets Columnist of the Orange County Register and a Certified Pet Dog Trainer. And this is Fly. Something that can be very handy is to teach your dog to target your hand. This can be useful in teaching your dog to come when you call him, helping him learn how to walk nicely on a leash, and if you want to do some dog sports like agility, it's also a very handy thing. I'm going to stick my hand in front of his nose and wait for him to touch it. Good pop! I'm making it pretty hard for him to not do it. Good pop! Just going to wait for that little touch, then reinforce. Good pop! Gradually, I'll move my hand farther away from his face. Good pop! Change hands. Good pop! Move away. Good. I'm not saying anything because he doesn't know what it is I'm asking him to do as far as a word goes. I want him to understand the behavior first. I'll add the word later. Once he knows the behavior, I can add a word to it. Touch. Yes. And when I know he has the behavior, I can start asking him to do it a couple times for each treat. This helps make the behavior stronger. It's kind of like a slot machine. If we got payoffs every single time we stuck money in a slot machine, we probably wouldn't play for very long. It would be kind of boring. But if we don't know, that's part of the excitement. It works the same way with our dogs. If they get a treat every single time, they might get kind of lazy. But if they never know if the treat's going to come, they'll perform to their best capacity every time in hopes of getting the payoff that time. Touch. Yes. Touch. Yes. Good pop. 